vlog real quick we are camping right now once again i actually it sucks because i actually recorded a camping vlog previously but actually you guys didn't see it because i didn't think it was that good honestly so i mean the last time you see me camping we were at bonnaroo but now we're back um it's actually just me and becky this time but we have the car parked and we kind of got we're for all the oregon motherfuckers we're at trillium lake never been here before it's kind of close we usually do dispersed camping this one is more of like you have to reserve a spot and they give you like I said, an allocated location but it's really close to other people which is interesting so it almost feels like Bonnaroo almost but yeah you can see like there's another car like right there like they're all along like this kind of road here it is interesting but yeah um but you do get a little private little area we're setting shit up right now that we i mean becky per usual is setting everything up but you know i'm here for moral support while she sets up the campsite but yeah this is kind of our little area but yeah well you got this little nice table which is nice and then she's setting up the tent doing all the work i just wanted to check in just so you guys can see kind of what the campsite looked like Wanted to do a quick, a quick update. We're about to make some fucking dinner. We just got done swimming. It was really nice. Becky's walking back. She asked somebody out for a fucking can opener. We doing that, but yeah, we're about to whip up some fucking dinner. Um, honestly, on that lake was so beautiful. I'm gonna try to get some, um, some maybe sunset vibes with it um, later. But yeah, it was really really nice. We just sat on a fucking tube, got a couple drinks, and sitting on the lake looking in the mountain like that's something that like i don't know most people could even fucking do it was so 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 nice i'm really glad we have a table too because now it's like official i can sit here and vlog easily but yeah we're about to cook and yeah i'll keep you guys updated it's really nice right now because it was like 100 degrees today but since you're in the mountains and it's like a little higher up the temperature's lower so it's like 85 right now I mean, it's like nighttime what's well, about the sun's about to to drop but it's gonna be really nice so i'm excited Unfortunately, there is like a fire ban right now, so we can't have a campfire. Otherwise, we'll burn down the fucking forest, which stinks. But hey, man, it's, there's some compromise always. So, um, but yeah, otherwise, we're just chilling. We're having a good time. But yeah, I've had an, having a good experience here. And this is like the first time I've done, um, other than bomber, of course, but other than like group camping. I don't know what this is actually called, but like camping when there's like a bunch of people kind of nearby. It is interesting. But um, yeah. You feel safer, I guess. That's kind of the benefit. You don't have to worry about like a bear coming to fucking like snipe you while you're fucking alone in the forest. So I guess that's good. But other than that, I do like the dispersed camping just because you are kind of like more secluded. You guys can be like loud, play music and shit like that. So there's probably the cons to everything except at nighttime. It just fucking feels like it's scary hours. But other than that, we're good. Um, but yeah, we're just chilling, about to make some food. But yeah, I'll keep you all updated. But yeah, otherwise we're having a we're having a blast, but
crusty crew we just got up it's kind of cloudy right now because it's it's going to rain soon so we just got up and, and making breakfast right now certain things you just can't film and it really does suck last night we went on a, a walk at like midnight maybe and of course we're like in the middle of the forest near a mountain there's like no lights so we went over by the lake that we filmed earlier and we um, looked up at the sky and there was so many fucking stars there's just no fucking light obviously but it's pretty cool you download this app and you can actually like point your camera at the sky and it actually tells you what the constellations are so it's pretty fucking sick and especially when you can see like majority of the stars it is pretty crazy to see and connect the constellations so that's what we're doing and it was pretty fucking sick especially with the lake um, even though it's dark of course you can still kind of see the silhouette of it and everything and then uh, the stars were reflecting off the lake we even saw like a couple of shooting stars which was really nice we saw a really cool one too so I was really excited alright guys welcome to my cooking segment today Making bacon, hash brown, and eggs. A cooking classic. I'm using my bean sport for our bacon. It's looking extra thick and extra juicy. Travel hack is to put all of your eggs in a container so they're already pre scrambled, seasoned, and ready to make. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this is like literally like goaded food. Yeah. Like why? Like it's like cooking. No, oh, yeah. It's it's kind of fucking me up right now. No, oh, this is really sick. We got this pan for thirty dollars. We gotta plug it. Where the fuck's the box at? We have it. Uh, oh, it's sitting. All oh, the camera's on the box. But um, it's like it's a Coleman grill. It's thirty dollars. The camping stove. But it's literally amazing. All you do is put the butane fuel in there and then and that bacon looks so I know. fat anyway um <laughs> you literally just put the fucking butane in the thing and literally just ignite it and it it's actually cooking like it's i feel like usually camp stoves are like pretty low temp this one you can put a cast iron on there and make a fucking steak like a hundred percent and this is like on low heat like it's like the minimum heat the bacon is like really cooking michael i love you but the camp stove that we were using in Bonnaroo, man, that shit was just, it, the temperature was just low. I mean, like, it, it did what it needed to do, but like yesterday we were like searing them damn hot dogs. For $30, this is it. It's a steal. Not a paid sponsorship by Coleman, but if you want to, man. in the car now. I think we're gonna probably head back and probably potentially close out the vlog. We're gonna get food and kinda end out the vlog. But yeah, I appreciate you guys and it was a fun experience. Hope you guys had a good time with the camping vlog. But yeah, <laughs> I love you guys very much and I'll see you guys next time.